Hey, what's up, y'all? Y'all already know what time it is. For those of you that follow me on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, y'all know that not too long ago I got to meet Kelly and Michelle from Destiny's Child. Don't ask me where Beyonce was because you know she wasn't there. But um, I met them in Beverly Hills at the Nike um, store. So, y'all, I'm going to post the pictures. Y'all, hopefully, I mean, y'all can see it, I'm sure. But um, quite a, it was a, it's a full day. Like, I don't even know where to be in. First of all, um, me and my friend girl, um, Sonia, my mind is kind of just like everywhere right now. Um, we went to Neiman Marcus, the restaurant, or the, I don't know how she told me. We went to the restaurant Mariposa. I think Neiman Markets is the, the mall, I guess. Um, why did I think it was called Neiman Markets? I heard like Trina and other artists, rap people say it in songs, but... I just, I always thought it was markets. But um, anyway, the food was good. I got my leftovers. Y'all saw me posting on Instagram when I bought some leftovers. Um, it's a mess, but it was good. I thought the pasta was going to be like noodles, but it was like, it's still pasta, but it's just like macaroni pasta. It didn't make sense. But it was good. The menu was high. The prices were ridiculous. But I'm just saying I ain't had to pay. So thank God for some of you. <laughs> I've been I've been balling out same night with no money. Went to the got treated to the Cheesecake Factory. Life is good for me. All this suffering ain't in vain, huh? But I still load on my soul. I'm gonna get to Kelly and Michelle in a minute. I also bought some Nike shorts. Not that y'all care, but I'm just saying. So, anyway, this is the story with Kelly and Michelle. So, um, of course, we was already in Beverly Hills. We was at Neiman Marcus. We finished eating. We took a whole bunch of pictures. You know, we sampled some perfume, some cologne. Got some samples from Barney's. You know what I'm saying? So, we just doing it. You know what I'm saying? And so, uh, she said, well, let's go on. You know, we was walking down the street, goofing around. You know what I'm saying? Because we grown. That's an inside joke. But, um, anyway, so... You know, she's like, let's go to the Nike store. I'm like, cool, because I already got a gift, a gift card I got back um, some time ago. I don't know where I got it from. I think I might have uh, returned some shoes or something like that. And um, I had the card. So I was like, okay, I could just pay the difference for where I get. So we was walking around, rocking around. Apparently, she had saw Michelle. No, she said she saw, she saw Kelly. But it's always different when you see people in person because, I mean, most of the time, they never look exactly how you perceive them. And I know with me from the other celebrities I've met, um, you just never know what you want, you're want. you going to get for one. You know what I'm saying? When you approach them, sometimes they be like, yo, I'm busy. I'm with my family. They might have a nasty attitude. They may have a, a nasty disposition. Like, you don't even want to approach them. Like, a nasty aura about them. So, you just never know what you may get. But, right before I was about to leave the store, you know, Michelle had passed me on my left side. And your first reaction, like... Clearly, I know who she is, but I'm like, oh my god, that's Michelle. So, I'm just trying to, you know, she was stop shopping for shoes, obviously. I didn't want to just like, hey, can I have a picture? You know what I'm saying? So, I was waiting patiently for a little minute. And, you know, I kind of stood in front of her, bad kids from my side. But uh, I kind of, not. I want to say slid in front of her. But uh, I walked. I was like, you know, uh, I said, Michelle, when you have a chance, can I have a question? She said, yeah, sure, give me one second. So she came over, and she, I already know because I follow her on Instagram and all that stuff. Uh, she's a straight clown. Anybody who knows Michelle know how she get down. She is straight fool. She the goofy one out of um, Destiny's Child. The goofiest one, to say the least. And you know she don't play that. She'll get right into you quick, fast, and in a hurry. So um, uh, my hand was shaking. I was like, all right, let's do a She's like, oh, take a selfie. She's like, uh-uh, uh-uh. Because uh, uh. I wanted my friend, I wanted Sonya to take a picture. But she's like, no, take a selfie. All right. And my hand was like this. <laughs> and <laughs> it was just a trip. She said, oh, I'll do it. <laughs> it, she was just, it was just so funny. Like, I love her personality. She's like a genuine-hearted, cool, down-to-earth person. And she's worldwide famous. Like, you know what that means when you got that type of money, when you that type of celebrity, and you're that cool. Like, 
if anybody in Hollywood know what I'm talking about, you know what I'm talking about. Because it's no joke out here. Some people and celebrities are heartless. They don't care if you bought 20 CDs or 100,000. They don't care if you're their biggest fan. They treat you like nothing. You know what I'm saying? And so while we was talking, by the time we finished that, and, you know, I was super amped. So you got her pictures. I got my pictures. You know, we was going over the pictures, like, just in shock and awe. He, Kelly, you know, I don't know if it was her, her husband or whoever, or her fiancé, but she passed me, and it's that same feeling again, like, oh, my God. And then it makes sense, like, okay, Kelly, Michelle, you know, not I, I, obviously I wasn't expecting Beyonce to be there. But, um, so I've been wanting to get her picture, but that, by that time, you know, by the time we finished pro procrastinating and on, doing all this, um, you know, she kind of left, so I thought, and... So I was about to check out, and I uh, asked Michelle, I said, can I take a picture with Kelly? He, she said, you don't have to ask her. But she, I guess she had went outside by then, or she left, or whatever the situation may be. So I asked the person that was with her, which was a dude, I'm like, can I take a picture with Kelly? He's like, she went to the next door. So, you know, you kind of let it go. I'm like, dang, that's what I get for procrastinating. And one thing I realized about uh, meeting celebrities and things like that, it's, it, it could either be yes or no. It's just that simple in life when it comes to auditioning or anything like that. You can have a whole bunch of fears. At the end of the day, what is going to be? It's going to be a yes or a no. You get it or you don't. Move on. You'll feel a certain type of way, but you'll get over it. That's just the way the cookie crumbles. So me and her walk outside. You know, we tripping off of Michelle picture or whatever. I said, I really wanted Kelly picture. Like, you know, that is like a, a dream come true, so to speak. Low key. So we get around the corner. And I said, I hope Kelly would just be outside because this would be great. You know, we just tripping, whatever, saying whatever. She said, I said, if I see Kelly, I'm finna run down there. And when I tell you Sonya was holding my, like, this, like, she said, no, you not. No, you not. You know, like, she said, she, you're going to embarrass me, like, going through all this stuff, whatever. Just, you know, playing around. And lo and behold, who walks out the Nike store on the, in the, on the back end? Kelly and Michelle. And they taking selfies and stuff. I said, girl, you better let me go. It, it about to get real serious. So, you know, I approached him nicely. Again, obviously Michelle remembered us from a few minutes ago. And she's like, oh, I'm like, Kelly, can... I said, I don't want to run up on y'all. Uh, is it okay if we get... Uh, can I take a picture with you, Kelly? He said, sure. She's very nice, sweet, humble, just as pretty and chocolate as she want to be. For some reason, I thought she was closer to my complexions, but she's very much lighter than what I imagined. She got body. She's just pretty. Like, she had a little bob or whatever. Just pretty, just pretty, and then sweet. But Kelly, and, and, and some of my friend Sonia said too, she like, I don't know what it is, Michelle looks so much better in person. They make her look old with that makeup. You have, <coughs> excuse me, you have a perception of these celebrities, and sometimes, the, you know, it's a good thing that you don't meet them because they may be straight a holes, and then sometimes it's good that you meet them so you can see. Wow, they really cool. Everything I thought, they like the complete opposite. You know what I'm saying? And I got to take a picture with somebody that's worldwide famous. Most people in the world will never, ever see Kelly and Michelle. They will never get to take a selfie with Kelly or Michelle. Like, are you serious? So I'm blessed and I'm grateful for all that the Lord has been doing in my personal life and all that the Lord is going to do. I'm getting ready to take flight off in this gospel industry, so I'm excited about that. Stay tuned. Make sure you guys follow me on Twitter, Instagram, Facebook. Make sure you share this video. Thank you for following me. Thank you for all my to all my new subscribers. Uh, make sure y'all catch up on my old material. I got a lot of interesting videos, a lot of interesting series. So this video is a little bit longer than what I imagined it to be, but hey, it is what it is. Be blessed. I love you guys. And stay driven.